right? Sí. Yes. Okay, so let's get started with some Duolingo exercises. So let's do this one. Dustin, go ahead. He perdido sí. mi tren. He perdido mi tren. Perdido mi tren. He perdido mi tren. Yeah, so Dustin, ¿alguna vez has perdido algún vuelo o algún tren? Ah, un vuelo, un vuelo. Uh, sí. En Miami. Miami. Miami, ¿hace cuánto? Ah, uh, um, eh, en uh, 2011 es horrible. ¿Y por qué? ¿Por qué lo perdiste? Uh, porque uh, security, seguridad. ¿Seguridad? Sí, uh, por ejemplo, um, uh, cuando voler aquí necesita, necesita ir a seguridad mucho, mucho, es horrible. Y seguridad es... Uh, eh, 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 me paré y yo, uh, o oh no, eh, eh, perdió mi, mi vuelo. Uh -huh. Horrible. Ok. Uh, ok. Ok. Uh, Frey, which is the correct answer? Eh, I have. I have missed my train. Yes. Okay. Have you ever missed any any flight or train or bus? Uh, uh, yeah, yes, in Bogota. Okay. We, uh, I don't know if you know. Uh, we have two airports. Uh, el, two international el, airports. International air. No, 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 no international. Uh, local flight. Okay. And okay. So one is we, local, we have, uh, and the other one is international. Inter no, inter no, never international. You send one local flight oh. because um, there, there are two airports in Puente Aéreo and El Dorado. And I, I was wrong of airport. So I. Oh, <laughs> shit. <laughs> so you didn't know. You went to the wrong airport. Yes. Exactly. When was that? Oh, fine. Finally, the company gave up, gave up a new flight. Mm -hmm. So, but why, why was this misunderstanding? I mean, like, why did that happen? Like, you were the one who didn't know that there were two airports yes. in Bogota? Or... Yes, a, mis a misunderstanding, a misunderstanding. So, because but who was it? Like, you always, didn't know? Always, uh, always, uh, uh, always, Avianca use... Uh, Puente Aéreo into to the uh, El Dorado, so I didn't know that I, I didn't have this information. So, ah, uh, okay. I, when there, was that? There are, there are a lot of, of flights from Bogota to Santa Marta, so they uh, scheduled us in another flight later. Okay, okay, fair enough. So let's continue. This one, you have closed the door. Um, Frey, pronunciation, you have closed the door. You have closed the door. Yeah, and Dustin? Okay, um, ustedes han cerrado la puerta. Yes, Dustin, how do you say in English when, when, you, when you put your finger in the door but you can't, and you close it? And you you heard yourself. How do you call that action? I, I don't I don't know how to say that in English. Um, like, like you smashed your finger in the door. Or, or something. Yeah, exactly. Something like so right you through. say you smashed. You Let's smashed see. your finger in the door. It smashes like a potato. Let's see. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. In Spanish, we would say we would say eh, me machuque. Like I machuque. I smashed. My, my finger. ¿Vos qué otra cosa dirías? Pues yo no sabría qué más decir pues en sí. español. Eso suena muy colombiano, no, no, no. pero... <risa> pero yo no sabría... <risa> sí, okay, eso suena muy machetero, pero, no. pero yo no sabría qué más decir. No, me, macho... me lastimé el dedo. No, me lastimé, no, no, sí, no, no. pues... No. <laughs> me lastimé. O sea, so the thing that we're speaking is that we would always say me machuqué el dedo as in I smashed my finger on the, on the, with the door, right? 
Sí, sí. But it, but it just sounds so Colombian. Like yeah. it, it doesn't sound like like but there is but we cannot think of any other way to say that. So so that's what, what I was asking Frave if he if he thought of anything else. So the other thing would be me lastimé el dedo, but that but that wouldn't that wouldn't imply that that it was with a door. But machuque is so specific. It's very specific. Like if you say that, people will understand that you mean that it was with a door or like with a window or something. Okay. Okay. Yeah, exactly. So let's continue. Um, Dustin, pronunciation. Ella ha presentado su idea. Sí. Uh, ella ha presentado su idea. Again, ella ha presentado su idea. Ella ha presentado su idea. 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 Yes. And Frey? She has present her idea. Idea. She has presented her idea. She has presented her idea. Okay, good. So, uh, Dustin, when was the last time you smashed your finger with a with a uh, door or a, or a window? Uh, no sé. Um, uh, y no sé exacto, pero es horrible. <laughs> so would you so so would you say that you smashed your your toe as well when it happens with with the with the with your bed when you wake up in the middle of the night? Sí, sí. <laughs> okay, okay. And uh, Frey, when was the last time you smashed a toe or a finger? Uh, last time. No, I don't remember. Some time ago. Ah, uh, <laughs> uh, yes. And we say, ay, we puta. <laughs> <laughs> that's good. Ay. That's good. Yeah, like, for example, when you smash your toe or, or your finger, uh, Dustin, so in, in English we would say fuck, right? Like, sí. fuck. But in Spanish we say, we puta. We puta. <laughs> yeah. We would say that, we puta. And like, that's like, fuck. When, when you yeah. kind of. <laughs> sí. About anything that just happened to you or just happened. So <clears throat> let's go on. Uh, 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 she has just arrived. Pray pronunciation. She has just arrived. Just arrived. Just. She yeah, has just arrived. Just arrived. Okay, Dustin? Sí, sí. Um, uh, El acaba. Mhm. Mm uh, llegar. De llegar. De llegar, sí. Yeah, Dustin, what do you do? What do you do right after arriving from a long flight or from a long trip? Uh, en mi casa, normalmente. Uh, Dormir solo. <laughs> I just okay. sleep. Okay. How, how long? Oh, God. This guy is always passing by when I'm recording a lesson. Can you believe that? It's like, and I know him, but, but this time is not convenient. But anyway. <laughs> Can you believe that? I mean, this is the this is the most this is the emptiest street in Bejo. This is one of the emptiest streets in Bejo, and and he 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 happened to pass by right where I am right now. It's so inconvenient. Does that but, remind okay. you of Humphrey? What what? Does that remind you of Humphrey? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Anderson, I don't think you. Anderson yeah. is is playing Danny. Danny's who? What is Masamorra <laughs> in English? Uh, Dustin, remember his name is Dustin. 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 Yeah, I mean, but no, you explain. You explain. You explain him. What Masamorra <laughs> is? I don't know. His uh, son is is, is is uh corn. <laughs> okay. Like, uh, White corn, uh, you prepare in a press pression pot. Okay. In a, uh, would you say that like high pressure pot? High, a high pressure pot <laughs> for sí, sí. one one hour, 
and you add some milk and sugar. Um, eso sí tiene pero, azúcar. No, yo no creo que eso tenga azúcar, o sí. No, 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 no. You, you add after. Ah, ya, 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 ya. Sí. Ah, okay, okay, okay. okay. I, I don't know if you in in if in Medellín you eat the mazamorra with sugar, but in, in Bogota it's common to use sugar or uh, condensed milk. Conde but do you put it inside mazamorra or do you just eat, eat mazamorra and then you keep... Hold on, hold on, it's passing by. <laughs> <laughs> mazamorra is like this. Is it, how do you spell it? I don't remember Frey. Is it with Z with Z or with an S? Masamorra. M Masamo. M M A Z A M O R R R A. So did I did did I do it right? M A Z? Yeah? Yes. Okay, Masamorra. Yeah. Yeah, it's like, it's it's a weird stuff. Now that I think of it, I mean, I like it, but it's a weird stuff. It's like corn, and it's like, you just you just eat it. It's like corn with with water. It's weird. It's a, it's a weird stuff. You haven't tried that, have you, Dustin? No, no. Yeah, you should definitely try it. I mean, like, like foreigners don't usually like it. Like, I, I've realized that foreigners don't usually like it. But it's worth that you try it at least. I mean, next time you come, you should definitely try it. Uh, but it's something that we have like some sort of a dessert. Like, like we've got lunch and then at the end we would have mazamorra. Like it's some sort of a dessert and we would eat it with something sweet. Here in Medellin, that's how we, we eat it. Like not sugar, but like guava dessert or like sugar cane dessert something like that okay. so, and, but, but, uh, anderson in medellin you 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 use you, you usually uh, eat mazamorra before the bandeja paisa yes no hey. después, después de after after i like i like a dessert or Sí, como, sí, pues como al final, al final siempre es, o sea, okay. es raro comerla antes. Sí, generalmente uno incluso se la llevan es después de que, de que pues, lo, al menos en los restaurantes que yo he ido, se la llevan a uno es al final. Pensé o sea, uno pide la bandeja para paisa. Para abrir el apetito, pensé que era para abrir el apetito. No, abrirlo, antes eso le quita el hambre a uno, uno con <risa> pasado de <eso. risa> No, es, bueno, se toma un pasa uno, una, una taza de mazamorra y con bocadillo y ya, 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 ya se le quita el hambre a uno, ya no, ya no come nada. Cuando no tiene, tiene mucha plata, come la mazamorra y ya. No, no, um, creas. But the paisa is uh, usually like como sachicha y yes. pan y huevos, arroz, ¿correcto? No pan. But, But you know what? There is something tricky about it. It's, it's because it, there is no translation in, in English for what it actually contains in bandeja paisa. It's not a salchicha. It's not as in a hot dog salchicha. ¿Cómo, cómo, se le dice? ¿Cómo le decís vos a un chorizo allá en Canadá, Frey? Eh, es, que, es, que, es que es como el sausage, pero, pero es que una sausage también puede ser una, una, un salchichón, ¿no? No, es es una salchicha, pero no, no, no es no hot dog, ¿entiende? Yeah, it's, it's, yeah, it's a sausage, it's, it's a, some sort of a sausage, but it's not a hot dog sausage. Sí, claro, claro. Yeah, like, I wouldn't, I wouldn't know how to explain it, because it, it is made differently. Like, it got, it's got, like, more meat, if you will. Yeah, I think sí. it's got more pork meat, pork meat, and I don't know what else, maybe some vegetables i'm not sure what it's got but it's got more than a regular hot dog sausage Perfect. so so it's it's tastier it's tastier than a than a, than a usual hot dog sí. yo sausage. recuerdo bandeja paisa in medellin and you didn't try mazamora after it uh no i don't think so yeah because you would remember it's corn it's pretty much corn it's got some flavor and yeah it's just it's got a strange 
I, I don't know. It's it's something weird. That's a that's a weird thing to try out. <laughs> now I think I mean I'm used to it, but but that's weird. Like corn and it doesn't it doesn't look like or it doesn't sound like like something delicious. But I like it. I, I sometimes I'm so so lazy to make breakfast that I just eat that. Ray was saying that that it's one of the ways to to kind of skip a meal without having to 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 to, to stand like some hanger sí, so, sí. so yeah i mean so that's what pero en bogotá si sí la toman antes de antes del, del almuerzo eh, no instep tú como o sea o es almuerzo o es o es más amorra ah o sea yo lo hago acá pero porque soy perezoso o sea, yo, yo por, por la pereza hago, pues a veces como más amorro por no desayunar o por no almorzar, cualquier cosa. Pero, pero no, o sea, la más amorra siempre al final, incluso eso es como lo difícil. Uno muchas veces es como almorzando y uno es como que, no, pero yo dónde me voy a meter esa más amorra. O sea, uno imagina que uno como, o sea, que entonces siempre... llega. ¿Cómo, cómo? Es por take, por take out. Para sí. Sí, toca, sí, pero, toca. O sea. mira, una pregunta, ¿son varios los que están vendiendo o es el mismo que está dando vueltas a un parque? Sí, es algo así, le está dando vueltas aquí como a la cuadra. Es muy guay, insiste, pues, muy guay, insiste, guay. insiste. Es que despierten, despierten, no quieren desayunar más amorra. Entonces, no, pero mira pues lo curioso. Lo curioso es que, like, like today that I needed him to live as quick as possible, so, so he didn't interrupt so much, that he was like kind of staying in the same block. But today, I mean, that was today. But when I'm going to buy, I I listen to him and I and I put my shorts on. And when I go out, he's gone. He's gone. I'm like, fucking asshole. Where did he go? <laughs> like when I'm recording a lesson, he stays like like five, ten minutes. But when I'm going to buy him, he just he's just gone. He doesn't. I just listen to him and, and one minute he's here, and one minute he's gone. And I'm like, fuck. <laughs> he killed in there. Uh, Mazamorra, I mean, the guy, the, 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 the guy that we were speaking about, the guy who's, who's selling Mazamorra, the corn thing. That's the only thing he sells? What? Yeah, that's all he said. He sells. That's, and, and he's like going around all the, all the city. I mean, you know that I live in Bejo. So sí, sí. he's going from neighbor to neighbor, from neighborhood to neighborhood. Um, but that's, that's the thing that pisses me off, that when I'm going to buy him, he's gone in no, it's like, like immediately, like all of a sudden he's just gone. But I'm fucking recording a lesson and, and he stays. His objective is this disturbing. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, his objective, uh, his purpose is disturbing you. <laughs> yeah. I'm, I'm about to think that I'm about to think that okay, so, okay let's continue then um, um, okay the next now who's selling this oh it's unbelievable another guy <laughs> and, you know but I, I thought this was this was a, a more quiet place and these guys are selling fruit okay so <laughs> Yeah, right, like pineapples and stuff. Did you know that, Dustin? It, like, what? see. Yeah, I mean, they, they, how do you call that thing where you put sand? When you're building, like, in a construction si site, and people put some sand, and they kind of carry, and, it got, and it's got one wheel in front. How do you call that uh, in English? Like a wheelbarrow? A what? A wheelbarrow? I think so. So you kind of grab it with your two sí, sí. hands they, they, they kind of do that and they put fruit into that onto that and they just start selling stuff on, in, a, in every neighbor neighborhood that's what these guys are selling and but it's so freaking annoying hold up <laughs> um, what are they allowed to do it right now with the covid Mate, um, I mean, yes, when? yes, but but I mean, like right now, it's 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 a complicated thing because you know that Colombia is a third world country, sí. so there are just many people who are 
there are many people who are just, I mean, they make their living every day. Like, it's not as if they work for a company like these guys who are selling, uh, but we were telling you about this corn dessert kind of thing, or these guys were selling fruit. So they Jeez. make their living every day. Like, like they make $10 a day. $10 a day, it's all they make. And uh, if every day they don't work, then, then you know they they've got to pay rent. They've got to they've got to pay their stuff and food ultimately, right? See, si, see. Si. So I mean, the president wants us to be in quarantine and all of that shit. But but honestly, I prefer, and and I'm speaking for myself, and I think that's the approach that the president is taking right now. That I mean, what what would you prefer to to die of a from a virus, or would you prefer to 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 get stopped in the just right outside of the supermarket. So that's si, the deal. Si. Like 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 if if he doesn't if he doesn't allow people to work, then he's risking, he's willing to 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 make this a, a security, a safety problem. Not only a, a public health problem, but a security one as well. Si, so clear, clear. So that's why. So yeah, like like many people are like, no, but we should be quarantined and endure and all of that stuff. But but definitely, it's it's just impossible. Like I got lucky; I can do online lessons like we are right now. But See. it's it's a fact that 80 and 90 percent of population, I think, and I think that's the case in most of the world. Or I don't know, probably 70 percent, that they cannot work, that they they cannot work from their homes. So I mean. People just need to eat, so. Si, si. So even if, if the president, it's been now two months, two months since uh, since since we're supposedly in quarantine, but like this last week, we started to. The president gave um, a notice that the economy was going to be reactivated this week, and but, well, but there are some things that I don't agree on, like like schools i mean we can teach online and some sh shopping malls they're going to open them as well so i think that is too risky i think that's just more than he should have done but let's wait what happens and see okay um dustin go ahead pronunciation mi novio nunca ha bebido cerveza mi novio nunca ha bebido cerveza. Yes, and um, Frey, what's the correct answer? Uh, my boy, my wife, my boyfriend has never drunk beer. Beer, good. Eh, Dustin, ¿sabes cómo, ¿sabes cómo hacer cerveza? Eh, no mucho, uh, pero eh, a veces sí. A veces sí. Did you understand what I what I said? Do I ever drink beer? No. Oh. <laughs> so again, sabes cómo hacer cerveza? Una vez más. Okay, I'm going to show it to you. Sabes cómo, sabes cómo hacer cerveza? I made made home beer. Do I know how to make beer? No. No? Okay. And you're afraid. Do you know how to make? No. Any alcohol? Do you know how to make any kind of alcohol? Oh, no, no. No? Okay. It's a science. A science? Yes. I, why oh, why oh, do you say it's a science? Science? Uh, because it's not easy to make, to make beer. It's a very, no. I think it's a very complicated recipe. Okay, well, I have never made any, but I've got a friend who once explained to me how to make uh, cranberry wine, and oh, he, he also, yeah, he knows how to make cranberry wine, and he also knows how to make, um, like, honey wine. It was a weird shit, like, honey wine... I don't remember. He was explaining me, and um, I mean, yeah, it's a lot of work, but but you just need to know what you're doing, and it's not that difficult. It's and it's nice. Like I used to visit him when he was when when he made the the wine, and it was really cool, very, very nice. You've got to try. Have you tried that wine, Dustin? Cranberry wine? Mm, sí. Uh, no me gusta mucho, pero es bueno. 
Okay. Um, so this one, Frey, pronunciation. I have never called him. I have never called him. Good. And uh, Dustin, what would it be? Okay. Um, yo he nunca llamado. Yo nunca uh, lo he, he llamado. Lo he llamado. Sí. Again, yo nunca lo he llamado. Yo nunca lo he llamado. Okay. Eh, Dustin, ¿con quién has tenido la conversación más larga esta semana por teléfono? Eh, eh, con mi padre. Listo. ¿Cuánto duró la conversación? Eh, una hora o más. Eh, mi padre llama mucho. Okay. Your father, not your mom? No. Uh, mi mom, de ambos, ambos. Okay, so when your father call you, calls you, then he, like, like, then you talk to your mom as well. Sí. Okay, ¿qué tan a menudo los visitas? How long has it been since I visited them? Like, how often do you visit them? Oh. And normalmente una vez o oh, una vez cada semana, pero es dos meses más que yo vi. I mean, like you, you saw them, you visited them two months ago? Like I haven't seen them in two months. Okay, okay. Usually okay. before this, like once a week, I try to go see my mom. Yeah, I mean right now, but I mean you can, you can go out, can't you? Sí, uh, pero es peligroso porque mis padres <laughs> eh, son viejos. Ah, right, viejos, porque mis padres yes. son viejos. You know, saying viejos in Spanish might sound a bit rude. Like, we would say adultos. Okay, adultos, sí. Yeah, like, and people w would understand that you mean that they're old. Like, you sí. don't mean adult. But, but old, but it's like a polite way to call them. Like when you're speaking about old people, you would call them, ellos son muy adultos, ellos son muy adultos. So that means they're very old. Adult, adultos mayor. Yeah, exactly, adulto mayor, yeah. Mm -hmm. So, Frey, how would you say this? ¿Qué tan a menudo los visitas? How often do you visit your parents? Yeah, do you visit them, listo. And so, what about your parents? Do your parents live in Canada? Uh, no, uh, my father is passed away. He passed away, okay. Uh, and my mother is still alive. Uh, he lives near near Bogota. Okay. Um, but uh, he, she suffered the Alzheimer illness. Okay. Um, I tried to call her uh, once uh, two weeks. Once every two weeks? Every two weeks, yes. Okay, and who, who lives with her? Uh, my older brother. Okay, nice. How old is she right now? Uh, 78, I think. Okay. Okay. When was the last time that you visited Colombia? In December 2018. 18. Seriously? Why? <clears throat> because I try to visit them every two years. Every two years. Okay. Two okay. Years. Uh, okay. I, I, we have plan, planet to travel this year in December, but I think at this moment it will be impossible. Yeah, yeah, no, it's the same case that then that's in like visiting them, it would be just too risky. That's just too risky to do, like like visiting grandparents or like mothers who are just sort of old already, then it's it's not safe for them. It's not safe where, to visit them. Where the so. those team where did those team parents live? Lip. Uh, aquí en Kentucky, uh, pero en la ciudad es más grande, uh, Cincinnati. Ah, okay. 
I, uh, I, I was thinking that in another country. No, no, no. Solo aquí en los Estados Unidos. And why is that, Jerome? Because I mean, the for the COVID? virus. Ah, yeah. Because of the virus. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's like it, that's that's the thing. Like, 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 just the fact of loving them, it's although it's like kind kind of counter counterintuitive. The the good thing to do is not to visit them because I mean, like we we might not get that that sick like that easily, but they can. So. Sí. That's, that's fucked up. Eh, Frey, ¿cómo dirías esto en inglés? ¿Con quién has tenido la conversación por teléfono más larga esta semana? Eh, what is the phone call you have had eh, the conversation with? But as I said, come on, what, what's the longest phone conversation of this week? What the long, the longest conversation? What the longest conversation? Phone conversation. Phone conversation. Yeah. <laughs> what's the longest co phone conversation you've had this week? At This week. Pero ahí no pregunta en algún momento who. Mm, lo que pasa es que con el who sería más complejo. Podrías que, decir a como, veces te he visto que ponen el who al final. Podrías decir como who, who have you had, have you had the longest phone conversation with this week? Would you say this, Dustin? Sí. I'm kind of doubtful, like, yeah, like, who have you had the longest phone conversation with this week, right? Sí. Okay, so, Ray, how do you answer the question? Uh, long, long, long answer or short answer? Larga, 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 larga. Okay. I, uh, I have the low. I have had a long conversation this week with my mother. Mm -hmm. Oh no, but it's, uh, it's no truth with with my with my friend with my close friends. With your close your close friends or your best friends? Mm, with my best friends, yes. Okay, where are they? Where are they from? Are they in Canada or are yes. they from Colombia? Wait, they, they live in. Oh, he lives in Canada, in an, but, in another city near here. Okay, but is he Colombian as well or is he Canadian? Uh, no, he's Colombian. Okay, who, who was first? Who moved to Canada first, you or him? Him. Three months ago, three, three months before. Three months before. So you were planning together or was it just coincidence? Yes, together. Nice, nice. That's that's cool. Okay, so let's continue. Hablas francés también? Oui, je parle français. Actuellement. Sí. Porque Quebec y todo es en francés, ¿correcto? Eh, yes, but uh, eh, 50% French, 50% English. Eh, and all, eh, eh, especially, especially in Montreal, people speak English. Pero en Laval, por ejemplo, es mucho en francés. Yes, en Laval es eh, 70%. People speak French, but uh, um, I, uh, the country, the country, oh, Anderson, como decías, en el campo, country, in, in the countryside, the countryside, people uh, speak French, 90%. Wow. Nine, nine, 90% in the countryside? 
Yes. So if you don't know and, French, and it's a French. it's a complicated French. Yeah, like no. like kind of country country French. <laughs> yes, yeah, exactly. They have Fuck. their own lang lang lang. Quebecese. Quebec oh yes. shit. Shit. I mean like it's, diffi it's, diffi it's difficult it's to understand. Entonces como un francés montañero. Exactly. <laughs> Ay, marica, no. Peor, peor, no, peor. No, es, peor. No, Dustin, Dustin, y yo estábamos hablando de eso en otra clase que tuvimos hace unas, unas semanas. Like, do you remember that we were speaking about the same thing, but in the States, Dustin, that we were speaking sí, about sí, that, sí. that these people, like in English it happens as well. Like when I, when I run into people who are from the very countryside, in the states like like it's it's like a whole different story like it's supposed to be english but when you listen to them i cannot understand them i barely understand some words but i don't understand much of it it's it's so weird it's like another language it's so different so i mean like like why do they use so many strange words those are like old words right like see no sé exacto pero is is muy raro. It's like old-fashioned words. Sí, sí. Yeah, that's that's. I'm, and I mean, in French, like I I started I started practicing and learning some French some years ago, and I didn't like it. I just didn't like the the vibe of the language. So I I probably fuck. Hold up. <laughs> yeah. All kind of fruits. Well, papaya. Papaya I... in English is papaya. Yes. Sí. Papaya. <laughs> y piña is pineapple. Pineapple, yes. Masana. Avocado. No, no apples. Uh, it's more like, like to make like. It's not regular fruit like avocados, papaya. I don't know what else they've got in there, but. ¿Cómo se dice avocado en español? ¿Avocado? Aguacate. Aguacate, aguacate, sí, sí. Aguacate. I don't know, how do you call... Um, ah, fuck, hold up, hold up, hold up. Avocado sauce. How do you, how Guacamole? do you call like... Oh, so you call it the same thing. In Spanish it's the same way. Uh, guacamole. Yeah, it's the same thing. Um, okay, so let's do the pronunciation of this one, Dustin. La mujer ha pedido vino. Okay, la mujer ha pedido vino. Yeah, and the phrase, uh, pronunciation, the woman has ordered wine. The, the woman has ordered wine. Yes, uh, that's in. Pides vino, pides vino, o algún otro licor. Cuando estás en un restaurante. Uh, sí, uh, vino. Vino. All the time? No, 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 no. Realmente. No. What? Uh, rarely, like a raramente. Ah, rara. ah, sí, raramente, raramente. Or you could say, like, from time to time would be de vez en cuando. De vez en cuando. Yeah, what about you, Frey? Uh, usually, I order uh, a beer. A beer, every time? Uh, yes, every time. But every just time, one. Okay. Just one. Just it's a, a level alcohol permitted, forbidden. What? ¿Qué quieres decir? Solamente uno, una es permitida para ¿Cómo así que es? conducir. O sea, un... Ah, okay, 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 okay. The, the, how do you say that? That's in the allowed, the allowed quantity to drive. How do you say that? Uh, in English. The amount the, or the alcohol level to drive is very low. So, but how would you say it? Like, like I would, I would have the the allowed, the allowed See, amount. Yeah, the allowed amount to drive. The allowed amount to drive. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So, um, ten years have passed since he died. Pronunciación, Frey. Ten years have passed since he died. Listo. Y Dustin. Eh, han pasado 10 años desde que murió. Desde que murió. Okay, so, um, that's it. ¿Cuál ha sido 
la muerte más dura en tu vida? O sea, de algún, de algún ser querido tuyo o de algún amigo. Eh, sí, sí. Um, en enero, uh, el hermano de mi esposa, Charlie. Right. Yeah. Yeah, what, what, by the way, what, how's your wife holding up? Like, uh, it's different todos los días. It's different. Like, like up, like up and down, up and down. Sí, sí. Yeah, I mean, I, I can imagine. So, okay, what about you, Frey? Uh, uh, my when my father died uh, 90 years ago. Um, okay. So you yes. were still in Colombia. You were still in Colombia when when he passed away. Yes, it was in 2011, and okay. I and I got here in 2013. Mm, okay, so you were already planning to move to Canada when yes. he passed away. Yes, okay. but he didn't know. He didn't know. No. <laughs> Why not? Because we. Uh, Inform the family just three months three months uh, before we leave. We leave before leaving. Before leaving, yes. What What was the reason? What was the reason of letting people know we just three months in advance? Uh, because we have the costumbre. Uh, the custom. The custom to don't say people's uh, don't say things. Before they things uh, realize, uh, no. Are are ready before they are ready? Or? They, they are they are ready. <laughs> okay, we, okay. We believe that, that if you say the things, the things don't don't happen. <laughs> don't happen. Don't, exactly. Don't happen. Exactly. See? You know what? In in my case, is the whole is is the whole opposite of that because when I say it, it's kind of I commit myself to to fucking do it and go for it. <laughs> it's like, like I already told everyone that I was going to do it, so I've got to fucking do it. Por qué Canadá? Por qué no Europa? Oh, ah yes, because the my my wife cousin lives here oh see sí. they got here uh, three years before us sí. so he he okay nos contó todo el tiempo eh. try okay nos sí. contó todo el tiempo no, no, nos contaba nos decía cosas so, he he used to tell us he used to tell us He, he, he is, used to tell us about the Canada, the advantage to live here for to live here for our uh, children. So, uh, so yeah, yeah, like it was more more convenient. But did he help you? Did he actually help you to get everything yes. settled in Canada? Yes, exactly. Yeah, I, I mean, it didn't make. When, I, when we arrived here, he helped us to. To fa to to fa to found um, a house, a car, etc. Everything. Y, yeah, it's much easier. It was very helpful. Sí, y pero la otra cosa es uh, under. Uh, no sé qué sabes, pero no. Pero Quebec es como un país separado, en verdad. Correcto. Yes, correcto. So, so what's what's the deal with that? Like like do you actually need like a visa to get out of the other areas of Canada when you're in Quebec? Uh, no no no. Uh, we 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 are the the right to travel around the Canada. No no problem. Sure. It's the the problem is uh, it's, a, it's an internal problem between uh, French people and English people. It seems the Five hundred years ago. <laughs> sí. Por ejemplo, en octubre um, fuimos a Montreal y Quebec City. El gente en la ciudad de Quebec no le gustan cuando nos hablas en inglés. Ah, oh, yes. Like, yeah. they would not 
help us. I know. <laughs> no. So like so so racist is quite strong there, like to the point that they don't help you. I mean, it's y, got to be very strong. Eh, is tu experience similar or no? Yes, the same, same thing. So if you speak in English there, yes. people don't fucking help you? Si. No. They prefer, they prefer Spanish uh, than English. Seriously? I mean, but do they actually know Spanish? No, 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 no. But, but the, the Spanish is, is more similar than, more similar to French, French mm -hmm. instead to English. Okay, wow. I mean, that's, that's definitely... But that's fucked. I mean, like, like that doesn't even happen in in the I know, states, does it? Like, I know, I know. Sorry, no. and also because the Fre um, Quebec people they usually travel to Cuba because it's cheaper, so they like speak Spanish. Seriously? Seriously. So, so in Quebec, it's 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 uh, easier to find people speaking in Spanish yes. than in English. Yes. No, no, no. So, I, I think it's the same, the same relation or ratio, but uh, they prefer to speak Spanish than English. Okay. So Quebec is a state or a city. It's a province. It's a it's a it's a it's a, it's a province, but it is a state, but it is also a city. Sí, la ciudad de yes. Quebec. There are a city and there are a province. So basically, it's a politics problem that they've got inside the country. Exactly. exactly. It's Holy the shit. World. Okay, 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 fair enough. So let's do this one, Dustin, pronunciation. Sí, sí. Nos hemos convertido en doctoras. No hemos convertido en doctoras. Yeah, no. So, Frey, how do you say that in English? We have turned into doctors. Into doctors, good. Uh, Dustin, ¿cuándo fue la última vez que fuiste al doctor? Oh, eh, en agosto uh, uh, estaba el, el dentist, pero antes eso, no sé, muchos años. <laughs> okay, so estaba en el odontólogo. We would say estaba en el odontólogo. Odontólogo, sí. Yeah, you could say dentista, but I would never say dentista. Like technically you can, but it doesn't sound natural to say okay. estaba en el dentista. It's but at least here it's better to say estaba en el odontólogo. What about you, Frey? Uh, I think the same date uh, in in the. In the dentist. Dentist? Sí. In August? You were in August? In, in, <laughs> at the in dentist? August, September. Okay, okay. Um, let's see the next one. Uh, she said he forgot her birthday. So, pronunciation, Frey. She, she said he forgot her birthday. Her birthday. Her birthday. Sí, okay, sí. that's in. Bueno, Frank, bueno. Uh, Ella dijo que él se olvidó de su cumpleaños. Ok, have you... Dustin, <laughs> ¿alguna vez has olvidado el cumpleaños de tu esposa? Eh, no, nunca, nunca. <laughs> you better not. You sí. better not. <laughs> What about you, Frey? Eh, no, never, but... Eh, never, no. No? <laughs> I have a good memory. So, I mean, like, all that shit, I need to put it on my calendar because if I don't, it's like, I forget shit all the time. <laughs> so I need to put everything on my mobile phone. If I don't, I just forget everything. So the next one... Schedule the dates? What? Schedule or... I put them. I put them on my calendar. Uh-huh. I put them on my calendar, on my mobile phone. So every time there is a birthday coming up of a... Of a partner or a, or a yeah like like my mom or my father I need to put them on my calendar I don't I don't know them I know the months but I don't know anything else I forget them so. ¿Y cuándo es tu cumpleaños, Ander? <laughs> oh, that's the worst thing. It's on Women's Day. <laughs> Have you got Women's Day? 
in no. in in the, in the states. No, oh, I thought that was an international date, but okay, that's on the on on March eight. Ah, bueno, bueno. Yeah, uh, th that's a good question. I'm going to add it to my calendar. When when's your birthday, Dustin? Uh, June seventeenth. Ah, you're about to seventeenth. See. Si. And Frey, when's your birthday? Mm, November seventh. November 7th. Okay, how old are you, Dustin? How old will you turn this year? Eh, 33. And Frey? 47. 47. But 47. you look so good, like 47. Oh, thank you. Wow. Sí. <laughs> you look really, really good. Es bueno, <clears throat> muy bueno. So, sí. this one, Dustin, the very last one of the day, uh, ya nos hemos presentado. Ya nos hemos presentado. And Frey, how do you say that in English? Uh, we have introduced introduce ourselves now. Otra vez, now we have introduced ourselves. Okay. Now we have introduced ourselves. Okay, so that's it. ¿Cuál ha sido el público más grande al que le has hablado? En, un, en una clase o en un, o en una, sí. en uh, un auditorio. Uh, normalmente en mayo, cuando tenemos un graduación, yo necesito hablar, pero este año no necesito. Ok, ¿cuántas personas? ¿Cuánto ha sido la mayor cantidad de personas? Uh, en el año pasado, 2,000. Shit, 2,000? Oh. Sí, horrible, Fuck. horrible. I mean, like the biggest group I've talked to has been like 50 people. Sí. <laughs> That's the biggest. What about you, Frey? No, eh, no, I am not. I am not a good eh, speaker. A speaker, <laughs> in public. No. I'm not a good public speaker. I am. I'm not a good public speaker. Okay, good. So. Guys, I already told you, like, you can download these lessons, but I'm still uploading them to the channel. So okay. you can either download them yourselves or you can see the lessons on my channel. Um, so you can review them as many times as you want. So yeah. I'll keep you posted. That's in. Can you send me your availability for next week to my WhatsApp? Yep. Yeah. Okay. So because I need to start another lesson right now. So we'll figure it out on WhatsApp. All right. See you guys. Okay. Okay. Great. Talk to you next week. Okay. Okay, have a nice one. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.